The Internet of Things is a concept, a term, that has been around for a few years, but a lot of people are still struggling to understand exactly what it means. So I wanted to create this video as kind of a brief explanation, a simple explanation for the Internet of Things. So my view and the way that I look at it is that imagine any device with an on and off switch, any device with a battery, any device that's powered by electricity that will one day be connected to you or to other devices. In fact, by a lot of estimates in the coming years, we're talking like 2020, uh, we're gonna have 20, 30 plus billion connected devices on planet Earth. And these are devices that range from cameras, like the one I'm using to shoot this video, to cars, to toothbrushes, jet engines, parking meters, literally anything and everything that you can think of is going to be connected. Today, for example, it's pretty hard to even buy a TV that isn't connected. Chances are, when you've pulled up to your local parking garage, you may have seen that they now have digital displays that tell you how many spots are in there. That is powered by the Internet of Things. Sensors that are being used to monitor traffic patterns. Companies are using this inside of their organizations to design their spaces. They monitor the flow of traffic as far as how employees leverage space inside their buildings. Imagine one day waking up in the morning, your alarm clock automatically starts your coffee maker. Your coffee maker lets your car know that you're gonna be down in 20 minutes. Your self-driving car pulls around, picks you up, on the way to work, your self-driving car notices that there's a bunch of traffic. It automatically sends a signal to a meeting that you're supposed to have uh, that you're going to be a couple minutes late. And so this is the, the kind of world that we might one day live in, where everything and anything is connected to each other and to ourselves. And a lot of people wonder, well, why would you want to live in that kind of a connected world? But the idea there is for productivity, for efficiency, to make life easier for us. And that is the world, this connected world that we're already starting to live in. And the question that we all need to ask ourselves is, are we ready to live in that kind of a connected world? Next time you even go to your local store to pick up a, a coffee maker or some sort of an appliance, look and see if it's a connected device. Chances are it is, and right under our noses, we are creating this connected world, and one day, we're gonna wake up and realize that we really are living in the internet of things. We really are living in the internet of everything.